news of Scotland and we are today driving past Loch Ness again I'm really really excited to see Loch Ness we're going to actually stop today at Loch Ness and just go down just have a little look for Nessie and just for my special little person I'm going to throw some shortbread in to the lock only a tiny bit so yeah we're just leaving Inverness getting ready to hit the shores of the famous and my favourite lock, Loch Ness. This is where we're going to pull over if we can get a parking space. I mean it's quite a big one as you can see, it does show that a coach can go in there. We have stopped here before because I couldn't wait to see it. So this is where we stopped at Loch Ness, this lay-by. Really good if you're only trying to do a quick stop. Um, you can get down, get to see the lock. There is snow-capped mountains in the distance. It's a clear day. I'm out of breath because I've just, I've just walked up a load of steps. I got my photograph, which I wanted. So yeah, well worth a stop. Definitely worth a stop. amazing views from here it really is my favorite lock so bye bye Loch Ness see you soon there is plenty of places to pull over if you just want to get some pictures of Loch Ness where we did stop there is actually steps down to the lock it's the first it's the first parking main parking area, parking area. yeah route. Virtually as you come from Towards, Inverness, yeah. travelling down the A82 from Inverness to Fort William. It's the first lay-by that you see and it is big enough for coaches. It is a big lay-by. Oh my goodness. Driving 
driving down the Great Glen Way, which is the A82 from Fort Augustus to Fort William, oh my goodness, there is, it's the Nevis Range mountains we can see in the distance. There is locks on the side. to go back and try and show you look at them what an absolutely amazing morning there's Ben Nevis woohoo we've seen it properly <laughs> wow Favourite um, bridge. <laughs> favourite, I've 
my favourite. That looks, favorite. that snow is lower down the mountain than it was on Monday. In fact, I think that is snowing. Is that snowing there over it? Uh, I can't look over there. No, you can't look, but it was not as low down the snow. But yeah, Anthony thinks that's his favourite mountain, that one. My favourite mountain at Glencoe, I think I like the Three Sisters. Oh, that is. Are we heading over there? What I can see? Yeah. That is proper snow. Moor, isn't it? So there is snow on Rannick Moor. Oh dear me. <laughs> Did not look like this five days ago. There has obviously been fresh snow. Wow. Come and drive down this road. Go and experience it for yourself yeah. because you want so you actually see how pretty it is. You don't believe it. You hear, you watch videos, and nothing tape can show you what this is like unless through your own eyes. No. It doesn't does it, does it do it nothing does it justice? Super imposed doesn't it? We're still on the A82 and we're near the bridge of Orkey and I didn't have the GoPro on and I'm still crying but we've not seen any stags at all. That's all I, I kept saying I want to see a stag and I thought I'm not going to see one. And we just drove down the road and there must have been five or six of them just in a field. And I've started to cry. Wild, just, wild not wild, not farmed. Not farmed, just there they were and that is it ticked. I have we did see them. I've seen them before when we've been up in Scotland, but I haven't on this trip. So I have it's ticked that box and I could cry because oh, right. I am crying. It was amazing. They were just literally at the side of the road, like that, next to me. Um, so, yeah, I didn't have to go to King's House, where they come and fed. But they're not wild. I actually saw them in the natural habitat. So, um, it's ticked every box yeah, now. Quite privileged. Yeah. I want just one as well. That was the point. It wasn't just one. It was a... I don't know what you call a group. What they called a... But yeah, they were there. Good. Group. A group of stags. I don't know what the name is, but I saw them. Bill was asleep. She missed it all again. We are pulling into Inverary. It looks really, really pretty. Oh, look at that. Wow. Oh, this is gorgeous, Anthony. What a find! I mean, I don't know where was what where was stains going to be like, but how gorgeous is this place? Wow! Look at that bridge. Oh, this is lovely. What a pretty. Oh, there's a. This is a really pretty place. Historic jail. Jails. Inverary Jail. That sounds like the dog. Oh, this is really pretty. It's fish. Oh, it's fish. He's been fishing. Wow. Look at this. And this is Lock Vine. Yay. I've been right, calling it Lock Vine. I don't know why. I keep going. There's also co-op in there, you should know that. What a lovely, lovely place. Oh, there's a rainbow over the lock. Oh, this is lovely. Right, so the sat-nav was taking us to the wrong place. I don't know what she's been doing today. So 
yeah, the, it looked it looked nice, but a pretty place this in Inverary. Yeah. Is that how you pronounce it? it is. Really, really pretty place. I think this is the hotel here. Right on this corner. Right on this corner. Wow. Beautiful place. Is it here? Yeah, the entrance. There. Is it? No, it's not that one. We will get there. Here we go. Just indicate. I'd say it's this one. Looks very busy. Maybe go in there. Mm. Do you want me to get out? So this is the Lock Fine Yay! Hotel, where we are staying for the last <laughs> two nights of our Easter Scottish adventures.